Alright people, welcome back to some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's play in some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Tag Force 5. So, we had a couple of difficulties, technical difficulties, in the last session of Yu-Gi-Oh! Tag Force 5. Uh, someone commented on it, and I replied, and I said, you know what, I'm sorry, I apologize. Uh, but I think I got the issue fixed, and you know what, I really do think that I got the issue fixed. So I got a new graphics card, um, you know, we're recording with OBS, so we're not screen recording with Camtasia like we would usually do with this series. It's now recorded on OBS, uh, so we shouldn't get any frame drops, high priority on the uh, OBS, above average for the game, and uh, hopefully everything goes well. So, if you guys can do me a favor in the comment section below, tell me pretty much, hey, you know, this quality is fine, or, you know, you change this, tweak this, etc., etc. Of course, I'll be keeping an eye on the setting, but uh, everything should be great for the session. So, uh, last time Tag Force Rock, we really ran around dueling against randos, uh, trying to look for some main character casts, because for some reason it seems like I can't find any. Uh, opened up a couple packs, and that was pretty much it. Uh, for this session, uh, I came to Leo's and Luna's penthouse, hoping to find maybe Leo and Luna, and we came across Akiza again. So I guess we'll play another fourth session with Akiza, and I only got like a quarter of her heart filled. Like, god damn. <laughs> uh, so I believe if I keep on asking her about people of interest, I'm hoping that maybe she will, you know... To be like, these are people I'm interested in right now, and then she can like mark them on the map, and then I could see where those main characters are, and then maybe I can ask them who they're interested in, they can say Akiza, and then they can mark Akiza, so it could be like a full circle, and I know where everybody's at. Because we've been spending a couple of episodes here, literally just, you know, walking around in circles, asking, uh, oh, dueling against randos, looking for main characters. So, um, I guess we could talk to her, flirt with her a little bit, you know. Um, guess can. Convert ghosts? I've never seen that card before. I like how she says good for you, like I'm some kind of child or something, you know? Like, she doesn't take me seriously, she doesn't think that I'm a man, but I'm gonna show her how much of a man I am when I beat her in a duel a couple of times in this episode. So, uh, I don't know, I guess I'll just do... Uh, maybe she's like, no, girl, you be, you be looking good, so... Uh, what is that, level 2 tuner? What's that? So, I guess it would be... Oh, I clicked the wrong thing. Oh, I, I literally did the math wrong. Good job, Mr. Math Teacher. I literally did math wrong. I looked at the monster, and I was so thinking, I was like, level 2 tuner, that's obviously a level 4. You gotta go sink 8, but that was a level 6 monster. I'm not used to seeing level 6 monsters on the field. Let's, you know, let's run that back. You no, know, and the sad thing is, I, I had plenty of time. So obviously, this is a sink 5, you know? I, like, looked at the card, but I didn't really look at the card, if you know what I mean. So... Like, really? Like, really? What time do you go to bed? Like, what does that look, you know? Alright, I can redeem myself with this question, so now it seems like it's a sync six. You know? You know? Yeah, you are. You're perfect just the way you are. You know? Like, girl, you, you should look, look at her! Tell me! She got the curve, you know? So, I don't know. I'm not sure if I know how to play a game, so I'm not even gonna touch it. Really? I mean, if you just wanna duel, you know? Uh, I believe I have some gifts, but I don't remember. No, I don't. I need to go purchase some more gifts. So, hopefully. Uh, soon I can go ahead and have down where her location is, but for now we'll just go ahead and duel. So, I spent a lot of money on this computer, and of course YouTube is screwing over everybody when it comes to, you know, ads and all that. Not that I made much money off of this, uh, off of this YouTube thing anyway, I really didn't, like, uh, I mean, I'm making less, I'm not gonna lie, I'm making less than I did before, which is weird because I have more subscribers and I get more views, but I'm making less because of the whole YouTube thing. Uh, but, I mean, it's not really one of my concerns. I mean, if I'm not making money off of this, I'm not making any money off of this, you know? And that's, like, literally, like, if you want to do YouTube as a profession, you have to. Like, you have to. You have to. I shit you not. You have to freaking um, uh, do uh, a Patreon. You do. But I don't want to do a Patreon because, A, I just don't feel like it would go anywhere with the channel of my side. And, B, I don't want to ask you guys for anything because I really don't need it, you know? Like, it, it just, it probably wouldn't get anywhere, you know? There's no point in me, you know, being like, hey, I'm going to start a Patreon. And then, you know, like, maybe have five people do a Patreon. And it's just like, okay, yay, five people are doing a uh, Patreon. It's, you know, it's just not worth it, you know? Plus, I have no idea what I would do as rewards, you know? It, 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 would, it would take a lot of time and effort that I'm just like, nah, it's, it's not, it's not really worth it, you know? Like, I've ever got to maybe, like, 10,000 subs, maybe we could talk, maybe we could talk, but, nah. Alright, so are you even gonna play your black card? Okay, you are. I was wondering if you were actually gonna play the damn card. <laughs> Alright, 
So there's Black Garden, yay. You know, it's Kiza, she loves her Black Garden. Which, it's not terrible, which, I can I mean, if she was partnered with me, it wouldn't be terrible. It wouldn't. So, we'll go ahead and summon Breaker, Breaker, put the token, and then Black Garden will cut me in half, of course. Oh! The, he's negating. I forgot that it's any monster. I thought it was my opponent's monster. Wow, I am fucking up already. Wow, I am fucking up already. So, of course, Doom Cow is going to fucking kill my breaker. Oh, I, I fucked up. <laughs> oh, I guess he didn't die. Alright, that's fine. Yeah. I, yeah, monster effects is activated. Yeah. I, I fucked up. I was like, oh yeah, yeah. I'll go ahead and kill you, but no, 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 no. I'm gonna kill myself because I'm a fucking idiot. So, I mean, there's not too much I can really do here. Really, I'm just gonna go break or break and destroy this fucking black guard and hate this card. It's annoying. Yeah. But now I'm only like, what? Yeah, I'm still only 800 attack. I'm still weak as fuck. <laughs> uh, I can attack your set. I mean,. There's no doubt that you'll have a booty way bigger than me, goddamn. So I'll take all that damage. Yeah, like, uh, I'll, I'll take that to the chin. Uh, and for now, I mean, that's it. I mean, I could use the Fissure Room, I mean, really, what's the point? I'm just kind of wondering if she's actually going to make, like, her boss, boss lady Black Rose or something like that. Possibly. So, I believe it tributes... If I flip up skill during now, I believe, I mean, that's it. Let me see, let me see. If I skip, flip up skill during now, then you shouldn't resolve your effect to summon from the deck, right? Yee. Good. Yep, done. <laughs> You're like, shit. <laughs> and that's just the kind of game that I play here, Kiza. I'm just a dick like that. I summon big beaters and stun the shit out of you. Wow, you don't even kill my breaker. Like, that's sad. But I can't get over the fucking head garden, so what is ready to show you one monster that has the lowest attack? So, that would be this garden. So, I get rid of this garden. Yeah. All that booty. Alright, so. Attack, and hopefully you won't have your fucking Mirror Force card. No, Rise of the Rollers. Oh, okay. Uh, so, that sucks. That sucks real bad. What's in my hand? All different kinds of shit. Alright, I'm gonna choose Thunder. Yeah. Wow. Alright, never mind. I thought I countered you. You countered me. You're like, shit. I, I heard your deck has different types. Like, this is a warrior. This is a beast. That's a, well, that's a spellcast. This is a thunder. Like, I did not think I would be getting hit with Rosary of Warlords today. Like, you suck, Akiza. <laughs> But, I mean, there's not too much you can really do to me right now. I mean, under skill drain, you, you're pretty, you're borderline uses. I need, like, Beast King or something like that. This cuts the attack, right? Yeah. And knowing my luck, you'll probably just have that big old booty head garden again. No, no, something different. Uh, just something to defend yourself, sort of. So we're we just gonna play the stall game of keys with, cause this really just seems like you're you're, gonna, you're just gonna do. You're just gonna sit here and stall, not do anything because you really can't. Oh, another fell spell. Never mind. Oh, that's definitely a counter to me. <laughs> you know. Yep. Pay them light points. Do a tribute summon. Yep. Pay a thousand. I'm assuming. No. Yeah, Two thousand. Yep. Oh shit. Don't know what you're summoning, but it's coming. It's coming. All right. Once per turn during your time, you can destroy one monster and have the lowest attack. Oh, okay. Well, you know what? I'm gonna try pull that. How's that sound? How's that sound? Uh, how's that sound, kid? Pretty good? Yep, salty. Salty. <laughs> now, I don't believe dueling gets up her heart as much as not dueling or giving gifts or doing etc. etc. Now, I guess I should have called the warrior. If we're called the warrior, it'd be pretty good. Yeah. yeah, still can't do anything. I thought maybe I could have like a loophole or something, but I don't think so. I think if I just set the monster and I I, I couldn't flip it up because it, when it flips up, it wouldn't be the right type, so. 
So, and you're running out of light points. You can go ahead and spend another, you know, 2k to go ahead and do another, uh... Oh, Destiny draw time. Ah, shit. Ah, shit. What is that, like, Lone Fire? Giga Plant or something? No, no, it's the background. I say that your, um... Your Thorn Mirror Force, whatever. Yeah, I should have definitely called Warrior. Like, holy shit, I'm like... A butt ton of Warriors. I believe I tribute for cost, because I believe Thunder King can still tribute for cost to stop an inherit summon. I want to say yes. Not 100% on that. Giant Trunade. Alright. So, we'll go ahead and just put everything back. And then she can activate it again. Oh, okay. Where are you going with this? Okay. I was like, wait, Nikita, where, 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 where are we going with this? Where are we going with this? So, um, it's gonna enter battle and attack, and if you have your freaking Mirror Force card, then fuck it, you have your Mirror Force card. Yeah, your Wall of Thorns, like, fuck it. Alright, so, it really just means that I can play a different type of monster now. Alright, and there's my room again. So like I said, I have to play a different type of mo uh, card anyway. So I'm dead. Rivalry can only control one, which I'm gonna play, be playing Warriors now, because I have a butt ton of Warriors. So that's fine with me. Are you a warrior? No, you're a beast. So. Uh, yeah, we'll just summon this guy. And I'll just sit on my back row. I said, Keys, I think this duel is still over. You know, even if you, like, Summon a monster that's possibly stronger than me. You know, I still got my, uh, my shrink. My shrink will probably fuck you up. So I, said, I think I gotta continue, like, you know, answering the questions that she wants to hear and giving her gifts. Like, it takes a long time for them to like you in this game. Like, holy crap. So, more drawn, more warriors. I didn't know my deck was so full of warriors. You know what? Now I think about it, my deck is really full of warriors. I got this guy, I got this guy, and I got some lengthy ones. I got Garrosh, yeah, I got, uh, no, Lila's a spellcaster. I don't think she was a warrior. She kind of looks like a warrior esque lady. But no, she's a spellcaster. And uh, I, I got a nice chunk of, uh, warriors with this deck, which is fine. It's fine. Alright. So, yeah, your wall of ivy. Go ahead and get a token. I don't care. Or no, no, the token summoned in my side of the field, but you can't summon the token in my side of the field because that would be a plant and I have warriors, so. Yep, so you're just gonna sit there and go on the defensive some more. Can we just end this duel? Like, we've been dueling for a while now and you really haven't been able to do too much, so. Just gonna continue summoning warriors. And yeah, I could death tornado your rivalry, but it's not really affecting me anymore like it was. Yeah, yeah, I can go off again, but like I said, once again, you can't give me the fucking token, and I'll just attack you for game, so GG. That killed two birds with one stone. So I'm, I'm really, this episode, I'm just hoping to get her to tell me her persons of interest, so I can see her persons of interest. Wow, I get fucking no money dueling her. Holy crap. I thought I got no fucking money dueling other people. Yeah, I beat you again. It's 3-0, so, you know. Like, I might actually have to, like, go somewhere else. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I like how it says, like, perform... Oh, I, I guess it could be other things. So can you just, you know, sit here and just keep talking? So, that's a tuner, isn't it? I believe that's a tuner, so I believe it would be a level 1 non-tuner, right? Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't even move like it's moving. Oh, I can only do this so many times. Okay. Alright, well now I know. Alright, so pretty much just when I come to her, just make sure that I, you know, do this all the time. Um, that's some kind of, uh, ace barrier, right? Yeah, like, like, I'm just going, I don't know any of these cards. I'm just going off of context clues off the, what the card's appearance is. Uh, Trust Guardian, I want to say? I mean, he's definitely not a flame emperor. Like, shit, look at that little guy. Like, no. You know? Uh, that's some hourglass of courage, I wanna say? It's not definitely a black one, you know? 
I'm literally just going off the context of the picture. That's all you can really do. Alright, uh, obviously that's, uh, some kind of... No, that's wrong. No, that was, that was supposed to be, uh... I'm going to say Fossil Dig, because they, the cards look similar, but not the other cards, so, my bad. And this, I mean, I don't even know how to do this right, so. Alright, so, I want to go here. Okay, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what we're doing here. Alright, well, I guess I'm done here. Oh, well, I guess I did it right. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not really good at that game. I don't really get it, but I mean, if it makes her more attractive. So I'm starting here, and I can connect to here, go over, and just go straight down to good, and then I can go over again and go down to very good. I'm guessing that's how that works. So go down, bad, bad, very good. So very, it ends up very good, right? Oh, oh, okay. I, I, I thought I ended it very good, but I guess I'm supposed to get all of the best combined? I don't know. I don't know, so I want to go good. Oh, I can move it! Okay. So I want to go back, and then I want to go back here. Nope, nope, I did it wrong. I did it wrong. I fucked it up. I fucked it up. I didn't know I could move it up and down. I mean, I didn't do terrible, but so I'm supposed to get the best of, of all of them. All right, so I'm starting here. So I go to very good, which is fine. Then I want to go over to very good again, and then I want to go back here, right? I believe that'd be good. So very good, very good, very good. That finally figured out this freaking thing. Oh yeah, I got I got her her liking this up a lot. Alright, so I'm just really just waiting for her to, like, kick me off of here and be like, alright, you can't talk here. So I go good. Can I go, like, super over? Yeah, I guess that'd, that'd be pointless. Yeah, I can't go up, so... Yeah, I just, I, I just fucked that up. Wow. Yeah, I just, I, just, I just pissed her off. She still likes it. Because I guess I did it, but yeah, alright, so I can't do anything with Akiza anymore, and we're already like 17 minutes up in this episode, so for now, like I said, I'm just going to go ahead and leave, see if I can find people of interest to tell me where she's at, and then buy more shit uh, to uh, give to her and flirt, and you know all that stuff, and then hopefully I can get her as a tag partner, because she'd be a pretty good tag partner, you know, her garden kind of fucks up my opponents, and I can get over the tokens that are summoned with my beater, so uh, yeah. So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's Play Yu-Gi-Oh! Tag Force 5. Uh, I don't think we had any technical difficulties, so hopefully it was great on your end, your viewing experience. And well, thanks for watching, thanks for the support. I really do appreciate all you guys, I really do. So if you haven't already, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, hit that bell for notifications, and I will see you guys next time with some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's Play and some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Tag Force 5 on Thursday. Alright people, thanks for watching.